Hi everyone, welcome back to another video, and I thought I'd give you guys a little update on the stuff I bought at Goodwill yesterday. As you can see, I put the trays, or the slats, whatever you want to call them, to good use. I put all my 12 by 12 in here, and yes, this is all my 12 by 12 paper. Um, this one has like, mostly, you know, single sheets, with the exception of this one, but um... I'll give you a side view over here. Hopefully you can see in the dark. And then this one has mostly my paper packs, pads, and some of my favorite single sheets. Like October afternoon and um, fab scraps. And here's the side view of that. And eventually when I get a new floor um this tray the shelving unit is getting it moved along with the um filing cabinet it's going to go on the other side and then eventually if i ever find a desk it's going to go along this wall because that's where the t cable and um tv have to be because the cable has to be hooked up on this wall and so we my cable the cable box tv my computer, this table's probably going to go to my mom uh, once she gets, so she can put her computer and computer on, and um, so it'll take the whole wall, hopefully, and like I said, the other side, this is going to go on the other side, and when it moves over there, I want to put these two up on the top shelf, I want to look at that. This is my 6x6 and my 8x8s. I have two more 6x6 pads I have to put in here. But, um, yeah. And then this is like my cardstock and my 8.5x11 papers over there. And then more cardstock and mat board and my light box and my two, um, Martha Stewart scoreboards, which I lost the bone folders to. They're somewhere in a box. And my die cuts, my dies, and I think this is all my dies. Oops, all my dies and um, my Boston folders. Yeah, I don't have a collection like a lot of people have. But anyway, so that's that. And then I decided to open my sewing machine last night just to see what it looks like. And this is what it looks like. I knew it was green, but I didn't know what color green. And it's a really cute green. I like it. It's not so dark ugly greens. And it came with the um, foot, which attaches over there. And it does run on four AA batteries. And it also came with some other goodies, like a bunch of bobbins. And a measuring tape, which I probably won't be using as measuring tape. I'll be using it for altered projects or mixed media stuff. And some buttons and a thimble. Um, needles. And this testing piece. And a bunch of, um, yeah, thread. <laughs> Um, black and brown, this is a gray and yellow, white, a navy blue, another blue, a pink, a yellow, another yellow, I think that's a yellow, or two, different no, two different yellows, and a red, and a seam ripper that's somewhere in the box as well. And this is just a perfect size for what I want to use it for, which is paper. Oh, I haven't sewn in years since um, middle school and home ec. A couple semesters of that. So that's it. And then the other thing is this. This was going to, this filing system was going to hold my paper if it fit in there. But since all my paper fit, fit, fit in the um, two wire things, 
I decided to use this as my collage fodder holder. And I have to get file folders out and organize all my um, magazine images and stuff. But this is what they're in for now. And um, these are got at Target in the dollar spot a couple years ago. And they work well, but it will be um, good to put them in a better filing system like this. So that's one of my other projects in the near future to organize that. Um, one of my other projects that I'll be working on soon as it gets here is um, I ordered two IKEA carts. The you know the ones that everybody has that comes in the ret cool retro teal not teal retro aqua color. Well, I ordered two of those but I ordered them in the in the dark gray because it fits with the color scheme that I have going. With the gray and the pink a accents but i really wish that cart came in pink but oh well um so i put those together one's going to be for me and the other one's going to be for my dad for all his medications and all that stuff to go with that so that will be my next project and it's on its way and it should be here by the end of the year so that will be my New Year's Eve project, maybe. <laughs> and um, that's it for now. And thanks for watching. Merry Christmas.